Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Fall Guys Fridays here on the channel. In the last episode, we had a celebration of finals games and such and played a lot of those. And for this week, well, starting off from Monday, the week of romance. Romance is in the air. Play Cupid in the Duos Festival show to shoot down those challenges and win big. Runs from the 14th to the 20th, which is Saturday. Uh, basically, one more day left at the time of the upload. Uh, Amazon Prime Rewards, we know the deal with that one already. Now for the Duos Festival, we're going to go ahead and select that main show. Buddy up with a fellow Bean and his team shows with an elimination final. I did try testing this earlier in the week and actually got to the final round in the second game. So we'll see how things go from there on that front. Uh, let's take a look at the shop real quick. Is my Sonic top back in yet? Uh, no, I. but uh, there is Sage here that I did accidentally bought. Uh, disclosure, I tried recording earlier in the week, and the recordings failed for one reason or another. Uh, and I accidentally bought this uh, because of it. Uh, it kind of looks like a Skyrim hippie, if we're going to be completely honest. But here's a week of romance. It takes two to beat the challenges, and right now, all the different criteria in order to meet it. You can get up to, like, a different color, a Cupid color, Moon and Stars pattern. Uh, you can get Swoony. The goose, or yep, or the duh, or yeah, the thing is the goose. And the top part of Swoony here. Now, one thing I do like to note from this angle right here, it looks like a dick. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, let's not waste any more time. Let's get into the game for the Duos Festival. Two beans per team. Let's see how far we can get. And I will see you guys for the first game. Alrighty, the first game of the duos together forever bullshit hoopsie daisy we have to jump through hoops I don't see any gold rings immediately however we still have to try to get as much as possible I am on the blue side here so my first goal is to go over yonder and here we go now that's great for the blue team so we're good there on that front oh boy I'm just going to wait up here. Mm. No, get it. Thank you, blue team. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Damn it. Okay. Right now, blue is in the lead. And funnily enough, uh, looks like we... Uh, interesting thing, thing uh, as well here. Uh, pretty much there was almost no fall, guys, uh, for this week here. Uh, basically, I've had some internet issues earlier in the week. I tried recording on Tuesday. Uh, the failings happened, occurred, and I can't seem to get a ring worth my life. Uh, Wednesday was horrible as uh, the internet went out, and all because the line outside actually fried. So, had to wait for that all fucking day, which was great. I was actually scared for a moment that I wasn't going to be able to record or do anything, because I forgot you need an internet connection in order to play Fall Guys. So... Yeah, so luckily though we do have one for this uh, for the Friday upload here, which is really really wonderful. Keeps the streak going. 36 weeks in a row with the Fall Guy episode. We're trying to go as far as we can. Hopefully do something special for 50. But uh, I don't know how you can do anything special for 50. But we'll see. Wow, no, we'll get there when we get there. But right now we still have 30 seconds left on the clock. I don't think I've got a fucking ring in God knows how long. Uh, let me go ahead and take this one up top here. Beautiful. Got the. Uh, Oh, fuck me. Oh, man. All right, let me just hang up on top here because uh, we're pretty good in the lead here. Red team is going to be eliminated. I, uh, it's not going to be much time before they're able to catch up. Uh, that's a red over, a gold over there. So, four seconds left. And we dive to victory. <laughs> oh, internet symbol on the top or the bottom right. Go fuck yourself. Anyways, how many squads remain? There should be two squads left. Or six squads? Okay. Let's see what the next game is. All right, everybody. Time to bring in your... Trying to channel in your inner LeBron James. This basketball. Four score points by getting ball to the opposing team's baskets. Oh, this going to be nice. It's going to be an interesting round of the NBA Finals. Channel the inner LeBron James or of a certain demographic, Michael Jordan. Jordan, not Jordan. Jordan. 
Oh wait, I'm I'm yellow. I'm yellow. That's right. Give me the give me the ball. Give me the ball. Get the fuck. Where's the ball? There you go. Toss it over. Be oh, okay. Hey, I'm trying to play D against here, guys. I'm the only one. You. Ah, mistimed. Ah, he got in the basket. One to one. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. No, you do not. You bitch. All right. Come on. Oh, come on. Come the fuck on. You f fucking idiot. Need a gold ball. There's the gold ball. Get it over there. Ah, damn it. One to seven? What the fuck happened? That's what I want to fucking know. All right. I swear, if I look on playback, it turns out one of my team sabotage. Like, okay. G gamers, I know you're out there. But please tell me you know what the fuck basketball is and how to fucking play it. I mean, come on. It's not that difficult. But we do got 100 cupid points from that one. And, yeah, let's actually go in and uh, let's go ahead and do another one right now. I'll see you guys for the first game for the second round of Duos Festival. And I think after that, we'll probably tackle a main show or two. So uh, I will see you in a minute. All right. Here we are in the game of Hoarders. We have to keep the balls in your area to earn points for your team. This game has not shown up on the channel for a bit of time, actually. I don't remember the last time this was actually played on the channel. I'm pretty sure I played this mm, just normally probably like a month or so ago. This is a game that really doesn't show up too much. Okay, can we not fucking do this shit again, please? I need my team to be on defense. Oh, my God. There's nobody defending. Just get your asses over here. Let me take care of getting the balls. Hey, I'm gonna go, let me go after yellow. Red balls are fire. Red balls are hot. Come on, I pushed it. There you go. Fuck out of here. There you go. That's how you do it. Ow. Come on, push it in here. Bitch! There you go. Ah! Okay, come here. Come here. Nope, no, no, no. Can't, 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 can't. You can't keep them all in here. You can't keep them all in here. You can't keep them all. There we go. Come on. As long as we have... Fuck. Get the fuck off. Bitch. Oh. Fuck you. Come on. We got 20 seconds. I just need one to go over there. Just one. Just one. Please give me one. Give me one. Give me... No, get it over. Get it over. Fuck. Well, that was bullshit. Okay, so that was another two rounder, I believe. That was even one. God damn. Okay. Well. Uh, you know, let's do one more duos festival. That this I've been eliminated too quick. Okay, so after this duos festival, then I'll do a main show to close it out. So I'll see you guys back in the next game. Alrighty, snowy scrap. Push your snowball through snow to grow it to its max size. Speaking of snow, here where I live, we are expected four to eight inches, which is by my calculations one so we'll see how it goes united states very known for exaggerating their weather patterns 
and just man oh wait that's right you have to push it you can't just that you can't just dive into it like the other game sorry i still have hoarders on my mind all right please tell me these guys know what they're doing fucking push there we go push it push it okay now push it towards this way this way No. Fuckheads! You dumbasses! What are you doing? <sighs> Fucking get it on the damn this way. Thank you. Now you fuckers understand? Son of a bitch. I, this is this, I I can't I, this is I hate team games. <laughs> I'm sorry if you can't tell by the time I was. It's just like, oh my god, guys. <sighs> nah, fuck this. I'm done. Y'all can do it. I don't give a shit. It's just like, what the fuck y'all doing? Seriously. Y'all don't know how to play snow. You you guys don't know how to play this. Push it against the damn fists. I guess red team don't fucking know either. Guys! Oh my god. Nah, fuck it. Fuck it. Just akin to real life, I work better alone. Alrighty, that was another one rounder for Duos Festival. Fuck this Valentine's bullshit. <laughs> Just, oh my god. That what you saw there was a glimpse of me on actual Valentine's Day. Just get my ass pelted left and right. All right, we're going into the main show here. I will see you guys for the first game. Hopefully, we can get past further in the second fucking round, or even past the first round. But we'll see. I will see you guys for that first one. Alrighty, here we are with the main show. Night Fever is the name of the game for today. Navigating the medieval obstacles and gotta reach the finish line, folks. Gotta know how it makes it. 60 players, 42 can qualify. Ooh, the saws, the seesaws are in play, though. So that may uh, change things up a bit. We'll see. But otherwise, it seems like a relatively normal course. And here we are. Let's go. Wait for the X. There we go. Beautiful. So far, so good. Oh, the seesaw. Oh, that was that was a lucky ass jump right there. I ain't gonna lie. No, I was holding on to it. What the fuck? Stupid fucking ratchet. There we go. And just, as soon as I get past that second one, I'll be fine. Get up. Thank you. All right. Two people have called. I think we're safe for now. Bam! Right on top of Santa. All right. Just keep moving, shaking and baking, folks. Ain't got no time for this. Ain't got no time for that. Fuck me. All right, no, we're cool. We still got plenty of time. That's I know that seesaw hold up a lot of motherfuckers. So let's just go ahead, keep moving, shaking and baking. There we go. Bring that down, and we're good. Eh, halfway through the ranks, but nothing terrible. I'm assuming that seesaw in the back is what's doing it. Yeah, uh, so far Garcia's struggling a bit. Oh, we got a few players in the back struggling with that. Uh, not too many left, unfortunately. Oh, everyone's up in front now. Uh, let me take out the, uh, IDs here. I don't like to do that. Uh, all right. Here we go. I feel like showing the online IDs during the race is a, a distraction. Oh, Garcia. It's, it's a big distraction. Distraction, really. Uh, seven more people left to claw. I mean... Okay. Oh, the round's over. 
Good attempt, guys. Unfortunately, though, like me in the last one, you're out. Only 41 qualified. On to round number two. Let's go. All right, everybody. We're about to have some fun with the new game of Season 6. We're going to hang, have some air, get some air time. So we got to stay in the score zone to get points. Use the pipes to get back to the score zone if you fall. Basically, the best strategy I found for this is just to drop and then go to either the left or the right, depending. You may want to hang on to the swinging bars to help gain a little bit of that extra, that extra leverage. Keep you in the score zone a bit longer, so to speak. Oh, okay. That was... Okay. Stop. That's fine. That's fine. 24%. Not bad. Not bad for a first... Come on, don't. There we. Ooh. 50. Damn, 60%. Not bad, not bad. All right, keep going, keep going. We can just drop. Oh, shit. That's fine. We'll do it again. We'll just drop here for a quick second. Uh, let will go this way. With 92%. Almost there. Uh, just one more, just quick walk off, and it should be fine. Yeah. And we're done. Flip right back up for that one extra percentage. Uh, 15 to qualify out of 25. This one at first will give you a lot of shit just because there's so much stuff in the way. And. But once you get down, once you understand and where the placements and how things work in this one can be simple if you know the right strategy like him like him going around like that that's also a great strategy just going around in a circle until you can uh basically get 100 percent uh you do have to have good knowledge of the course and make sure you know exactly where you're landing and such so that takes care of that Twenty-five beans remain. Next game. Oh boy. <laughs> well, folks, I think this may be the end of the episode. Valentine's episode doesn't like me. That's okay. I don't like Valentine's. <laughs> Here we go. <coughs> Excuse me. 60 seconds on the clock. Oh, and we got broken patterns everywhere. And it's two snowballs. So you got to be careful. See, there you go. There, just like that. And just like that. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. Let me, let me see the end of this game. I want to see how much. Yeah, he's gone. I want to see how much damage this does. Now, I haven't seen it happen yet. But, if anybody out there watching, if you know. Well, first of all, I didn't realize you can walk on the side of the thing like that. If you're not in a final game, but however, like in a survival game, this is not the final. If you are technically the last person standing, do you get a, do you basically win the game at that point? And there's only three players left. Oh my god. Give me the drop. Give me the drop. Please tell me it's a good drop. You know what? I'll take it. It ain't, the, it, ain't, it ain't necessarily the best kind of drop, but you know what? It's good enough for me for now, considering how the game went. So, all right. That was a three-rounder this time. I actually got past round two, which is what I, what I wanted to accomplish. And the 48 out of 60, just 12 more crown pieces needed for the crown. But that's going to have to wait for another time. Uh, next week on the channel, we are starting a brand new Let's Play. And we are starting Bloodstained, Curse of the Moon. The Kickstarter, uh, the additional Kickstarter fundraiser for Ritual of the Night that actually exceeded its goal on that. Um, but, however, to break up the monotony of that in between Bloodstained, I'm going to put 
a small little LP in between. I'm thinking maybe Contra. So next time we come back to the channel, you will see starting with Bloodstained, but in a couple weeks' time, just to break up the monotony, you will see some Contra, and then we'll continue from there. Until next week on Fall Guys Fridays, though, do like to thank you for watching. Hope you have yourselves a fantabulous day. Love, peace, and chicken grease. Good night.